This is Pandora, the world of Avatar at Disney's Animal Kingdom of Walt Disney World in Lake Buena Vista, Florida. It is the newest area of the Animal Kingdom which opened in 2017. It is based on James Cameron's Avatar. It was released in 2009 and was the highest grossing film in history at the time and had been until Avengers Endgame in 2019. Cameron first got in talks with Disney about making an Avatar attraction or even a land as it turned out to be back in 2011 and this area took three years to build. This place is absolutely stunning. It is unbelievable how well done this area is. I mean, look at that, there are floating mountains. Originally, this area was going to be called the Beastly Kingdom because it was gonna be centered around mythological creatures, which I hope Disney still does sometimes because that would be amazing. The storyline here is based after the conflict between the Navi and the RDA in the first movie. I'm guessing this is still going to be set before the sequels that are planned in the coming years. And a fictional tourism company has made an agreement with the Navi to allow ecotourism here from Earth. It was difficult for the Imagineers to try and make an unearthly computer-generated landscape of reality, but I think they pulled it off. The floating mountain's highest point is 156 feet, but they do use forced perspective techniques here to make it seem a lot bigger in person. So one of the big attractions here is the Flight of Passage, a 3D flying simulator. That is supposed to be really awesome. Unfortunately, I didn't have a lot of time at the Animal Kingdom and I didn't have a fast pass, so I didn't get to ride. It does develop and maintain terrifying lines all throughout the day, usually about two or three hours, so hopefully next time. Now I'm gonna be going on the Navi River Journey, a beautiful dark ride on the Cap Savan River. This is one of the best dark rides I've ever been on. 